the guilt plan. The field of blackbirds, also known as Kosovo. The people were divided. Serbia, Croatia, Bosnia, and Albania. The deployment rate is around 35%. Yeah, the ghosts of history on the Balkans. The power is here. The ship is here. Thousands of Kosovo Albanians fled their home. These borders are unsteady. I mean, freedom does not have a price. It's just not. It has boundaries, but does it really have a price? So. And it's not working anymore? No, no. Because Macedonia says no? No, no, no. It's uh, only built for the feast competition, you know. To, to make the point for the... Only, only to, to make the, the feast bigger, you know. So, with the situation in Kosovo right now, I mean, we've made progress, but we need a lot more. Like, people need us to do a lot more. What more can we give? There are a lot of people here that get tired of relying to these things and hoping that our dreams, you know, we finally make them true. I have said that one week that is overnight. that the Balkans have had quite the complicated history but I think that what people need to do is to sit down and once we agree on history we can move on to a better future which is going to be better for, for everyone. There are a lot of medias that get controlled by others and the public gets the information that is really not the right one. So we're trying to do something different and I hope the people will see it.
personally, I hold no prejudices and no hate towards any person, uh, be it Serbian or any other ethnicity, because I happen to be Albanian, somebody else happened to be Serbian, and that's not a reason to hate someone. So there's probably a guy just like me in Serbia and in all parts of the world who is just as cool and just as nice. So I have no reason to hate a person just for happening to be of a certain ethnicity or of a certain country. is now over. War happened almost 20 years ago, so that's now in the past. Uh, today Kosovo is free and independent. There are still some things that need to be settled. Uh, politics is very complicated and all that. But all in all, Kosovo is an ordinary country. I encourage people to come here and to see that people here are very friendly. Uh, we encourage more tourists to come to, to see what is around Kosovo, to see some places, to try our traditional food. So, Feel free to come and I think that you'll have a great time here.